Hey everyone, this is Judy and here are 5 important juicing tips to live by. I know it's tempting, but do not juice the same thing every single day. At the very least, do every other day because veggies sometimes have properties we might not be aware of which can actually be bad for our health if we overdo it. For example, juicing raw cruciferous vegetables every day can be harmful to you in the long run. By nature, vegetables in this family depress thyroid function, and your thyroid controls body temperature, hormone release, your metabolism, and other important things in your body. Cruciferous vegetables include, but are not limited to, kale, broccoli, and cabbage, just to name a few. So rotate your greens, or better yet, do a different vegetable or fruit every day for a month. If you're thinking that you don't even know that many veggies, I've included a link in the description box below to a blog post that gives you 31 different things to juice. Be aware that even vegetable juices can be high in sugar. That means it can convert to fat if you're not expending it as energy. So mix it up with smoothies, which has fiber to help eliminate some of the excess, or just drink less, or by balancing it out with the next tip. I hate wasting food, and even the idea of it makes me upset, so I encourage everyone to use the pulp. I save up a few days worth of pulp, and I've made breads, gross looking soups, and carrot based tacos. You can get inexpensive juicers secondhand. I purchased mine from Valley Village for under $12 Canadian. While some people swear by the $300 models and say that they're more efficient at extracting nutrients, you're already making nutrients easier for your body to absorb by juicing. So don't sweat the small stuff. I want to know what have you guys been juicing? And do you prefer juicing or making smoothies? Let me know in the comments below. If you found this video helpful, please remember to give me a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel for more natural health tips. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.